Because your soul will be turned to joy. Hallelujah. Uh huh. I will see you again. And your heart will rejoice. You're going to not remember all the pain that you went through down on this earth. Hallelujah. You're not going to remember when they mistreated you, Elabel. Hallelujah. You're not going to remember when they scandalized your name, said you did what you didn't do. Hallelujah. You're not going to remember when people lied on you. Hallelujah. You're not going to remember when you were trying to do right by people and they still did you wrong. Hallelujah. You're not going to remember that anymore because your soul is going to be turned into joy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How we can be excited knowing that one day our soul will be turned into joy. We can even rejoice right now. Hallelujah. 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 Uh-huh. And in that day, you shall ask me nothing. You're not going to ask me about what you went through. You're not going to ask me about why did I have to go through this? Why did I have to go through that? What were you meaning by that? In that day, you're going to be so grateful. Hallelujah. The Bible says in that day, for joy will you leap. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you see Jesus, you're going to leap for joy. Hallelujah. In that day when you see Jesus coming to the clouds. Hallelujah. You're not going to worry about why your children didn't want to go. Hallelujah. But you're going to leave for joy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You're going to be excited seeing them come back on the cloud. Hallelujah. The Bible says in Luke, the Bible said after Jesus had risen from the dead, he led them as far as Bethany. And he lifted up his hands and he blessed them. Hallelujah. And then he told them, go back to Jerusalem and tarry there until you're being down with power from on high. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We got the Holy Ghost. We've been endowed with power from on high. We don't have to weep no more. We can be excited. We can join right now. We can leave right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do you have joy? Do you have joy? Then it's all right to leap. It's all right to leap. Hallelujah. It's all right to leap. He said in that day, you will leap for joy. Hallelujah. 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 Huh? Verily, verily, I say unto you, whatsoever you shall ask of the Father, in my name, he will give it to you. Hitherto, if you ask nothing in my name, ask, and you shall receive, that your joy may be full. Hallelujah. You can ask the Father in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And Jesus said he's going to give it to you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When you're sick, you can ask the Father for healing in Jesus' name. And Jesus said he'll give it to you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. These things have I spoken unto you in Proverbs, uh huh? For the time coming. Well, I'm not going to speak to you in Proverbs or parables. I'm not going to speak to you anymore. Hidden, huh? Hallelujah. Paul let us know these things were hidden. Hallelujah. But he's not going to speak in Proverbs anymore. There's going to come a time where he's going to speak plainly. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. But I shall show you plainly 
exactly what I'm talking about. Hallelujah. Uh -huh. At that day, ye shall ask in my name, and I say not unto you, that I will pray the Father unto you, for you. For the Father himself loveth you. Because ye have kept my word. Hallelujah. He said, because ye have loved me. In that day, I won't have to intercede for you anymore. Hallelujah. Because you've kept my word. Jesus said, if you love me, keep my commandments. He said, in that day, the Father will love you because you have kept my commandments. Because you have loved me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because you kept his commandments. That's how you, he's going to know if you loved him. Because you were obedient to him. Hallelujah. He's not going to intercede anymore. Because the Father is going to love you. You're going to hear, well done. Good and faithful servant. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. And I believe that I came from my Father. Yes. I came forth from the Father. And I've come in to the world. And again, I'm going away. I'm going back to my Father. And I, yeah, uh-huh. Yes. Lo. Now I'm speaking that plainly. And you speak no problem. We understand what you're talking about now. Hallelujah. Seems like their eyes that just came open. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. Now are we sure that the Bible says Jesus knoweth all things. And all things were given unto him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now they were sure that Jesus knew all things. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. After this is, had been spoken, they were sure that Jesus knew all things. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. It needed not that any man should ask thee. By this, we believe that thou camest forth from the Father. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. Jesus answered them, do you now believe? Hallelujah. You got a good testimony. But are you living what you're testifying? Hallelujah. He said, do you now believe? Hallelujah. You're talking good. But do you really understand what I'm saying? Hallelujah. Do you now believe? Uh-huh. Behold, the hour coming. Yeah. It is now come that ye shall be scattered every man unto his own. And you're going to leave me alone. And yet I'm not alone because the Father will not leave me alone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh-huh. These things have I spoken unto you. That in me, you won't have to sit up late at night worrying about what's going to happen tomorrow. Hallelujah. I spoke these things, but you won't have to sit up late night worrying about how the bill's going to be paid. 